Hi guys, it's Henny. Welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to review the most wanted lip kit at the moment. So I'm going to show you three colors from the Kylie lip kit. So the lip kit was launched last year if I'm not mistaken and the first three colors were True Brown K, Candy K and Dolce K. Honestly, at first I wasn't interested in the lip kit. I was a little bit hesitant on getting it because it was just too hyped up. Also, the colors didn't appeal to me. Those are not the colors I normally wear. And I was never a big fan of liquid lipsticks, so I wasn't intrigued. But this year, Kylie came out with more colors that are more my colors, such as 22, Mary Jo K, and Posey K. And I thought I could pull those colors off. So I started to search for it and I asked lots of online shops on Instagram. But most of them didn't have it ready. I had to wait for one or two months and I just didn't want to wait. And the harder it was for me to get this lip kit, the more I wanted it. I know I'm sick. But then I found this online shop that sold everything I wanted except 22. I really wanted to get 22 but they didn't have it and I had to wait for another month and I just didn't want to wait. So I got Mary Jo K, Posey K and Candy K. I wasn't interested in Candy K, but I saw somebody wearing this on Instagram and she looked fab, so I just had to get this. The original price of this lip kit is $29. You get one matte liquid lipstick and one lip liner, but online shops in Indonesia sell this for $45 to $65, or it's about 600,000 rupiah to 900,000 rupiah. I know it's really expensive, but I think with the shipping cost, tax, custom, and the efforts they put into getting this lip kit, I think the price is somehow justified. Okay, so I've tried all these colors and I have a different opinion on each and every one of them. So I'm going to swatch the colors, the first impression style, so you can see how it applies, how it performs on my lips, and all that jazz. Oh, before I show you the colors, I would like to thank Imelda Nababan for suggesting a new background. Thank you so much for giving me a constructive criticism. I always welcome it. I'd like to thank my subscribers and my followers on Instagram too. They're all so polite. You guys always say please and thank you and I really appreciate that. And you guys are always really kind with your words. Even though you're giving me a suggestion or a criticism, you're always so kind with your words. So thank you, thank you so much for making my social media platform a positive place. I really, really appreciate that. Okay, so let's move on to the swatches. First, let me talk about the packaging. I think this is really young and edgy like Kylie. I really like it. If this was displayed in the makeup store, this would grab my attention because I think this is so eye-catching. Okay, so inside the box, you get one lip liner and one liquid lipstick. Okay, so the first color is Candy K and this is the lip liner. I really love the lip liner. This is just super soft. And here's the color. It feels really smooth on your lips. Okay, now the liquid lipstick. The smell is... It smells really strong. It reminds me of this cough medicine or this cough syrup I used to take as a kid. But this one has a vanilla scent to it. But it's really strong. It will hit you in the face. And here is the color. It glides really smoothly. And it dries within seconds. I can feel it drying on my lips right now. Okay, now I have to pose because I have to show you the color. But I can't do those cute and sexy poses when I'm swatching my lipstick. So I'm just going to do what I normally do. So I'm just going to do this and smile. Okay, so in terms of color, I really like this color on me. This looks really mauve and kind of brownish on my lips. But I have to be honest, my lips don't look healthy and cute. They look really dry. As you can see, my lip is really dry and all the lines are accentuated. To be fair, I have really dry lips and this color just doesn't sit well on my lips, literally. Okay, so the first time I tried this, I did this test and it didn't transfer. But then I kissed my nephew thinking that it wouldn't transfer and it did. And I left this lipstick mark on his chubby cheek. But at that time he was sweating so he was literally wet. So keep in mind if you want to kiss somebody with this, make sure their face is dry. Okay now let's put this lipstick to the test with some fried snacks. This is called bakwan in Indonesian or balabala in Sundanese. So yeah, let's just see. 
FYI, I hate eating with my lipstick on, but for the sake of this review, dang, it's hot. Oh my god, that chili was hot. Okay, so the lipstick survived for the most part. Let's see what happens if I put on a second layer. The application is still smooth. It is not patchy. It looks okay, so I think you can layer the color with this one, but immediately it feels dry again. Okay, so that was Candy K, and now we move on to Posy K. Okay, so now let's put on Posy K. This is the lip liner and this is the color of the lipstick. I really love the lip liner. I love how it feels on my lips like this before it's completely dry. Okay, so Posy doesn't dry down as fast as Candy, but it feels as drying. I like the color, but I don't like how it feels on my lips. If you're used to matte liquid lipstick, of course you know that it's always on the drying side, but it is not more drying than, say, Lime Crime. If you're used to Lime Crime, I think you are going to be okay with this. Okay, so this is Posy K. Okay, so now let's move on to Mary Jo K. Okay, so this one is Mary Jo K. The lip liner is just so soft. And I keep saying that. Okay, so that's the lip liner. So this is Mary Jo K. It's really beautiful. Okay, so this is Mary Jo K. I really love the color and the pigmentation. I think it's amazing. But it feels really drying on my lips. It is not as drying as the other two colors. But I don't know what I was thinking getting this lip kit knowing that I never got along well with matte liquid lipsticks. I should have gone with the lip glosses. Okay, so to sum up, I really love the packaging. I think this is really young and cute and edgy like Kylie. I really love the lip liners. I think this is one of the best lip liners I've ever tried so far. I can't fault it. This is really soft and pigmented and really easy to apply. If this was sold separately, I would definitely repurchase. For the liquid lipsticks, I love that they're so pigmented and easy to apply. Also, the colors are beautiful, but I just don't like how it feels on my lips. My lip is already dry. So I think it comes down to your personal preference. If you are looking for a matte liquid lipstick that is long lasting and that is pigmented and you don't mind the slight drying feeling and you don't mind the line that matte liquid lipstick gives you, then go for it. Will I purchase other colors? I don't think so, but I am going to keep this in my collection. So no, they are not for sale because my friends have been asking whether I'm going to sell this and the answer is no, I'm keeping them, okay? Okay, so that concludes my review. Thank you so much for watching and I'll talk to you soon. Bye guys!